The last time the economy grew at this rate was in 1984, and Ronald Reagan was telling us it's morning in America. Well, it's getting close to afternoon here. The sun is coming out. At the time, the CBO revised their long-run deficit projections down as a share of GDP. They just, they just have done. So the American Rescue Plan is strengthening our financial position, and it grows our economy. It's continuing to grow our economy. And the strength of our recovery is helping us flip the script. Instead of workers competing with each other for jobs that are scarce, employers are competing with each other to attract workers. That kind of competition in the market doesn't just give workers more ability to earn higher wages. It also gives them the power to demand to be treated with dignity and respect in the workplace. More jobs, better wages. That's a good combination. Put simply, our economy is on the move, and we have COVID-19 on the run. Yes, we have more work to do to get America vaccinated and everyone back to work. We're aiming for full employment. And that means keeping our pace on job growth, including for Black, Hispanic, and Asian workers. But this progress is testament to our commitment to grow this economy from the bottom up and the middle out. The American Rescue Plan provided resources to get shots in people's arms and checks in people's pockets. Schools, schools were struggling to reopen, so we made vaccinating teachers a priority, getting schools the much-needed support. In March, We've added, just in the month of March, we added 364,000 education jobs to the rolls. Small businesses and restaurants are getting crushed. Now we're delivering the loans and support they need to reopen and to stay open. This morning, we've learned that jobs in some hard-hit sectors, such as restaurants, hotels, amusement parks, were up by 343,000 last month, over 1.5 million in the past five months. And more help is on the way to give families just a little bit more breathing room. Starting this month, families are going to receive one of the largest ever single-year tax cuts that middle-class families have ever received. And it's called the Child Care Tax Credit. And here's how it works. In the past, if you paid taxes and had a good income, you could deduct $2,000 per child and that would come off the total amount of taxes you owed. You had two children, you owed $10,000, you'd take off $4,000. In the American Rescue Plan, we expanded that. Now, a, 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 a parent would get $3,600 for each child under the age of six, and $3,000 for dependents they have between the ages of six and 17. So instead of just being a credit against the taxes you owe, it's now a fully refundable credit, half of which will get paid out in monthly basis. Look, what that means is this year, middle-class families with two young children can expect to get — receive a $7,200 in a rebate, in effect, a tax return, with the monthly payments of $600 a month starting this month until it's paid out. 